Collective, how are you today? Whenever you're watching this, I hope it's beautiful. I hope that's your answer. I'm B, this is Sedaris LLC. Welcome or welcome back. We're gonna get right into it. Let's see, what does the collective, yee! <laughs> Where did it split, where did it split? We have let them go, somebody needs to go. And be honest with yourself. So you could be dealing with somebody you know. Yeah, you make a change. You know a change needs to be made. This could be any kind of a connection. You know, I, you, you could just be feeling like, I think it's time for me to really like float on away from this person, right on away from this connection. See what wants to come out right now for the collective. What do they need to know from the oracle right now? I always get oldies. Don't seek anyone's approval. If you're worrying with the decision, remember to, and the grand scheme, look out for your own interest in a situation. Always, you know, consider other people's feelings and all that, but at the end of the day, I'm feeling this is here because you need to look out for yourself with the decision that you could be making. Or just in your daily life, you're not needing to be caring about what anyone else thinks right now. Let's see. Yeah, it's time to do what you want. Paint the sun into your own sky. Have some fun. What else wants to come out for the collective from the oracle? I'm hearing it's my life. I do what I want. We have Spaceship, Don't Be Afraid to Sing. So some of you might be singers, or it's just time for you to, you know, go for it. Karaoke for somebody. Did somebody shock you out of doing karaoke or tell you that, does somebody have like a traumatic karaoke experience? <laughs> um, you're being encouraged to get back to it. Have fun, it's something that eases your mind and maybe you really can sing. Don't be afraid to show it. Like. I'm getting the image of somebody who goes to karaoke and they just play along with everyone else and pretend like they can't sing, but they have a beautiful voice. You should go to one of those karaoke places that has the um, private rooms and just sing your heart out. People sing beautifully in those private rooms at the karaoke places. Sing your heart out. Somebody's being encouraged to do that. Then we have, remember to practice self-love. Yeah, that could be a healing practice for some of you whatever art form you do. Some of you could be painters, sketchers, I'm hearing sketchers. You might do like graphic art. Some of you could be graphic designers and you do that in your spare time. We have witches coming. There's a sword there in her closet. There's a bat there in her closet, but you know, she's closer. Well, she's actually closer to the bat, but <laughs> she's got some tools in there. And I hear somebody's going to bat for you. Excellent. And then here we have this again. We're all just stardust. So somebody else around you may be taking up for you in a situation, speaking up for you or um, about you in closed doors, behind closed doors, creating opportunities for you. Excellent. Saying your names in the right room, collective, yeah. So you have a good connection somewhere, but there's someone else that you wanna let go. Hmm. You're not seeking anyone's approval. I feel like this is you, yeah, defending yourself, doing your own thing, having a good time, maybe not telling everyone your moves like that stealth energy we had in yesterday's reading. If you haven't seen that, maybe check that out. But overall, you are, I'm hearing unbothered. And there's somebody else who, I'm hearing they see you for your greatness. They see you for your greatness. My voice is doing something weird right now. I don't know whose energy this is. Maybe some of you will when you listen. It could be for someone. The tone of my voice, it's not normal. This is, it doesn't sound normal to me. It sounds different right now. But anyway, let's see. First out, we have the hermit. Maybe a time of reflection going within, keeping to yourself about something, or just in general, maybe don't wanna be bothered right now, that's the present energy doing, 
your own thing. That's the second time that's come through. We have what's crossing is people want to hang out with you. <laughs> you're, oh, I just heard you're in high demand. So people want to hang out with you or somebody wants to see you. This could be somebody from your past, friends, family, etc. Just people from around the community that you're in. They're curious about you. I'm hearing Madonna. Who's that girl? Senorita. Bonita. <laughs> um, so yeah, you're just trying to not be bothered. You're trying to just do your own thing. And I feel like you're succeeding. But the crossing energy is... People are ready for you. People are ready to see you. You brighten their days. Or they're just curious. We have that as well. Knight of Swords. But you have tunnel vision about something with the Knight of Swords being here. You got things to do. Emperor energy. You got things to do. Beyonce said that. Didn't she? So it's like, oh my God, yeah, that's so cute. I would love to hang out with you guys, but I don't know why I'm feeling like a Mariah Carey kind of energy too. Like, mm. <laughs> you said who's having a party? I don't know her. <laughs> oh, let me stop. But that's kind of what I'm feeling. I'm feeling like diva energy. You could be in that energy. And maybe not in a, like not in a malicious way. You're not trying to act funny or anything. You just really are focused on, perhaps you're focused on your family. You're focused on your kids. You're focused on your business. You're focused on just your life. The strength is here as your advice. Hmm, we're gonna clarify that. Yeah, and this could have to do with children too. You got a little lamb here and being drawn to the little lamb here in the strength card. Babies, some of you could be um, preparing to give birth as well, kind of getting that energy in here. And you're just not trying to be bothered. I feel like this is a, a special time for some of you if you are in that situation. Um, and you just want to be pregnant. I feel somebody wants to really enjoy being pregnant right now and not share that with a lot of people. Like you don't want a lot of people touching your stomach. Outcome, we have the Knight of Wands. I'm hearing party. So, okay. For some of you, there's no getting around it. Yeah, I'm getting a specific storyline for somebody who you don't even really want a baby shower. If anything, you would rather have your friends like treat you to a spa day, maybe a safe mommy massage. Um, or you just want to spend the day with, or I'm getting like a baby moon as well. You might just want a baby moon with your the father of your children. Um, something mellow, but your friends really want to celebrate you. <laughs> so you're probably going to still have a baby shower or a surprise baby shower or something like that. Um, and you're just really not feeling it. That's for somebody. For others of you, you're just trying to keep to yourself in general. You're trying to build something on your own. I feel like you've been recuperating from a situation or you're just minding your own and people are ready to see you. You might start to get a lot of invitations soon and your energy may start to shift and you'll come out of this Four of Cups. Yeah, we have the Three of Pentacles beneath that and you'll start to kind of work with people more and you'll start to, I'm hearing, um, I swear, I have like, <laughs> I have like an oldies track going on right now in my head. Um, I'm coming out. Yeah, it's like you'll start to go out and hang out with people more. You'll want to. Right now, you just haven't been in that energy. And it's not personal. You know, everybody goes through a phase like that sometimes. So the hermit here, what is the hermit doing here in the present energy? Mm-hmm. Something's about to take off. Eight of Wands, clarifying that. Yeah, something you may, um, some of you could be studying for something or you're preparing to. You might want to get some kind of a certification. As a side note, that's coming through. Maybe that's why you've been minding your own business, just kind of laying low. Um, but yeah, I keep feeling like you're going to just start hearing from people. They want to check in on you. Anything else on this Eight of Wands? You're not really here for it. Eight, 88, yeah. Then we have the King of Cups. This could be, you could be a water sign masculine. Um, it's funny because the Hermit, it looks like they're surrounded in water in this card too, but there's water beneath them. So it's like levitating. Both these characters here are meditating, but there could be um, a masculine energy that wants to come towards you or there's gonna be one reaching out to you. They could also be in their head about this. Hmm. 
What's this about? We have the Three of Swords and the Hangman. More water energy. Pisces. Hold on. I was making some rice. Give me a second. bad you guys oh my god you guys so clarifying three of cups we have the three of swords somebody wants to repair something with you i'm hearing let's start over by beyonce beyonce is really coming through heavy in this reading yeah there is a tower you could be dealing with the scorpio energy or you could just be dealing with somebody who yeah why am i hearing put you to bed Somebody who maybe you slept with in the past or they want to sleep with you. It may not have happened. Could be a male uh, masculine Scorpio energy if I'm speaking to a feminine. Can I get more on this three of swords, please? I feel like you're bored of the situation. I feel like you're done with it. And, and that's why you've been on hermit. So this person could perceive you this way. In this hermit energy but i do still feel there's people around you that want to to come out they're curious about you this could be mutual friends that you have with this person i'm not just i'm not necessarily feeling um, a committed relationship i'm just feeling like a lingering energy so this could be somebody from your circle who you don't really run with anymore and and they're wondering about you and this person has like feelings a lot of different kind of feelings for you okay but we did have the outcome here as the night of wands so it could be just something where they want to they i'm not really feeling it i'll tell you right now i'm not feeling it but let's keep clarifying mamas if this is you like if, if you're um pregnant and there's somebody from your past that's kind of weird to me that they want to come back but i've heard that guys do have some guys do have this thing for pregnant women i'm not going to go too deep into that because i don't want to <laughs> um but somebody could be like wanting to come in and swoop you up or swoop you off your feet sweep you off your feet swoop in knight of swords this could be their focus towards you but i feel like your focus is elsewhere your focus is strictly on what you have to take care of right now but let's see and it's ba it's ba it's basically because you're like not dealing with them they're suspended you suspended this person this could be somebody you went to school with I know I just heard in school suspension. And we have the King of Pentacles beneath that. Could be an earth sign as well. Um, yeah, they're stuck on you for sure, whoever this is. They want to celebrate with you, they want to have fun with you, but there's also some sort of romantic hang up they have about you. Um, what is this Knight of Swords? I'm hearing Don't Leave Me Girl by Black Street. We have the Six of Cups here with the Knight of Pentacles. It's somebody who can never really make up their mind. Somebody who's just moving very, very slowly. Like even in their mind, I'm getting the image of somebody saying in the mirror, today is the day, I'm gonna ask them out today. I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell them just how I feel. And like they're standing in the mirror and they're saying a plan. This could be from the past energy. Somebody like, you know, girl, I love you so much. And, and I just know that we're gonna be so good together. Like that song, I'm a movement by myself, but I'm a force when we're together. But it's like surface level. It feels, mm, I don't wanna say lackluster. It just feels a little bit, you know, it doesn't feel real. It feels like they thought you would look the part or something like that, but they never ended up asking you anyway. So, Anything more on this Knight of Swords and Six of Cups, please? Yeah, they wanna heal the situation. We have the Death card and the Four of Swords. It's been stressing them out because they never did say what they wanted to say. And you're off to new things. Like this is, you've been off to new things, I feel. Hmm. So what about this strength? Because you might be annoyed if you hear from this person. We did get the eight of wands earlier. So you may get some communication unexpectedly from this person. 
I have to say, I'm hearing boys to men, end of the road. We belong together. <laughs> and you know I'm right. And you know I'm right. So this person knows that you're not really feeling it or that it would be a long shot. Temperance energy, Sagittarius. You could be dealing with a Sagittarius. Yeah, this person wants sex for sure with you, or they did in the past. I'm hearing that Amadeus, Amadeus, rock me Amadeus. What the heck? <laughs> this is so random, you guys. Five of swords. Yeah, this is going to get on your nerves a bit. I think because this person probably had ample time to tell you this before. They may be a fire sign who moves like an earth sign or a water sign. This person is complex. They, they have like a, a chart heavy with maybe Sagittarius and Scorpio, or you could have these in your chart as well. It's like they're warring with themselves. Again, that image of the person in the mirror, like, girl, I love you, or something like, but still, it's like, they're, something about them is only concerned with the surface, the image, how it, it would look. Maybe this is why it took them so long. Maybe you're somebody who's not usually their type, or vice versa but they really did miss an opportunity with you. We saw the Four of Cups, right? And now they're wishing it could come back around and they may try to make that happen by reaching out to you. They may be disappointed to find out that you're with child if you're someone who's watching and you're pregnant. This could be somebody who's like, oh man, like somebody else, you know, I'm hearing got to it before I could. So again, I'm not getting a solid energy here. We did have this outcome. I feel like you already know this person enough to know it's not necessarily because that they're having bad intentions, but it's just because they can't be taken seriously for whatever reason. It would be a waste of your time. But at one point, this person probably did make you feel very good. You had a lot of fun. You probably had a lot of fun with this person. What does this card say? Don't be afraid to sing. This could be somebody that made you feel like singing or dancing. That could have been something you shared together. Um, just having fun, nights out, and something could have happened. There was some sort of a tower moment or just a dissolution, like parting of ways. And you may have been confused, like, well, what happened? And you moved on with your life. This person now wants to come and offer you what they should have offered you before. Yeah, now they want to come in as the emperor. But you already know what's beneath this. It's a page. <laughs> why? Do they want to come and try to play my collective this way? Like, why? Come on now. Why? Anything else for this strength card and the temperance? Lots of fire energy. Yeah, we have the sun, and here he is again, our king of cups. Yeah, so they know. I feel like they know that they weren't right before. They want to come back. They want to create a new world for you. I'm hearing that song, I'll Stop the World and Melt With You. They, it's not like they have bad intentions. Major Arcana is all. The strength card, temperance, the sun. This has been a learning experience for this person. This has matured them, realizing that they lost you. But the thing of it is, if they were to come back and you were to accept them, the energy here is that they would be in this Knight of Wands, which I do want to clarify because maybe you guys could get together and have good times again, but I'm more so feeling, see how this lion is like running rampant in the background, almost running away. It's like, that's all they would do. They would come in for a little while and then they would end up running away, 1919 19 on the clock running away, leaving you hanging. And I feel like when there was a tower moment before, it was brutal. And so you'll know what that is. I don't feel like you want to welcome this person back, which is why this that headache energy came with the strength card. So what about this Knight of Wands? What does the collective need to know about this Knight of Wands? I'm trying to figure out what I want to do with my rice. I don't really want to have meat with it. Mm. Yep. We have the Nine of Wands, clarifying the Knight of Wands. Focus on the new beginning, my baby. 
Focus on your family, focus on your little sheep, your little lamb. We'll call it a little lamb. Um, focus on your business, whatever you're growing and, and doing, or just focusing on growing yourself with the hermit energy because that's where you are right now. That's where your focus needs to be. This person, they put you in this energy, nine of wands. I'm like, okay, what now? So it's not like there's really trust here. Let's clarify again, knight of wands and the nine of wands. Anything else before I close this out for my collective? We have the lovers and we have the six of wands. So, yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. And I'm hearing score, like I'm hearing a crowd cheering. Um, just like the card, yeah, I'm hearing a, card, a crowd cheering. I'm hearing it from the card. <laughs> and I'm getting soccer. That could be important, that could be a clue for you. Soccer, maybe a soccer match. This could be someone who plays soccer or loves soccer. But it's like a score for them. It would be a score. Score! The crowd cheers. And then they're out of there. That's what I'm feeling. Because they have interests elsewhere. They still haven't grown enough to be ready for you. Your advice here is the strength, the temperance, the magician, and the sun. To see the truth of the situation. To remain on your path. To be strong. Because I feel that at one point you did care about this person. But they never stepped up. Okay? We've had this energy come through before. And so now they're showing up and their only major arcana and the outcome is the lovers. And I'm hearing they just, they wanna lay it down. It would be magical, it probably would feel great. I'm hearing it might feel like a movie. They've been waiting a long time, but there's somebody else in the background that they have a solid foundation with, but it can't be that solid if they're looking for you. Yeah. Somebody that they don't treat very well either with that nine of swords being there. And you don't want those kind of problems. You don't need anybody else trying to check somebody's phone looking for your name, trying to bring you drama if you have other things to focus on. Am I right? Am I right? Okay. I feel like we can close this up. <laughs> I do. I think collective, you're already gonna understand where this person's coming from. And even though it might pain you to turn them away, I feel like that's what you're gonna end up doing or even saying it's so good to hear from you if you decide to respond at all. Even if it's that you bump into this person, but I'm feeling more they're gonna reach out to you. And they're still struggling to do it, just like they used to. But um, yeah, they're not, they're not serious still, and I feel like you're in an energy where you're ready for something a bit more serious. You're not trying to have someone come in and waste your time. So that's what I have for you, Collective. Um, and this could be for a masculine or a feminine because women waste men's time too, okay? So don't be fooled thinking it's always the man trying to run in and out. Can't keep running in and out of my life. Could be some women too coming just so they can get that attention from a masculine energy and then go away. Um, so just be mindful. Um, take what resonates. Please do leave the rest and I'm, a, a, I'm going to affirm for all of us that all is well until next time I'll see you guys soon. This person may also stutter. I don't know. I was tripping over my words a few times through the reading All right. See you guys soon. Bye